cracking it's your home with little Rob coming at you from San Diego, Califas, putting it down for the brown side of town. Those are this Ocho Loco right here on Chicago Street TV. Homeboy putting it down, homeboy. Orale. Uh, 94, 227, 94 was the year. Gonshas is all I hear. As we lit up the place, we gave those vatos a taste. So I'm not to fuck around, but I got shot in the face. You know what I mean? So, um, that, that how and where have you been? How and where have I been? Uh, what was your first tattoo and how old were you? Um, honestly, I think my first tattoo was, uh... So when you started rapping, um, you were with LPG. How did you meet the guys from LPG? Do you still talk to any of the members from LPG? So well, then a winner in Chicago. Good luck with that vato. Yeah, it's just, it's, uh, it's cold over here, homie. It's pulled up right now for the freezing, you know? <laughs> <laughs> and I got out the plane, I was like, oh shit, I had to put my hat on and everything, you know? Yeah. Um, I noticed, too, a while back, you had slick back hair. You want to talk about, um... Why is it that you did that and now you went back to being on? Uh, yeah, man, just to, uh, you know, uh, I mean, it was cool, man. Just, I mean, I've been rapping since I was, since I was like 14 years old, you know what I mean? First tape came out in 92 when I was 16. Um, and I was over the 9 to 6 one night, a Mexican gangster. And then uh, after that, I recorded a couple more songs and it was uh, uh, Do My Thing and Soy Chingon. I did those when I was uh, 17. You got any upcoming projects as far as albums, singles, or movies? Um.